hi everyone thank you for tuning in to this recipe i am sharing with you how to make the most delicious ofada stew i'll be using cow skin cow tribes cow beef i'll season with peppers onions seasoned powder salt and stir I'll steam cook the meat on a low heat for 10 to 15 minutes without adding water. And this will take the meat to another level of deliciousness. 15 minutes later, the meat has started to produce its own juice. I'll add enough water to cook the meats. I'll cover and cook until they are tender. I'll be using combination of red bell peppers, green bell peppers, onions, I'll clean them up, cut them into small pieces and transfer them inside a blender or a food processor. I will blend without adding water. Bell peppers contains lots of water. I'll blend roughly. It doesn't need to be very smooth. I'll transfer the blended ingredients inside a strainer to help reduce some of the excess water from the peppers. I'll spread it out and then allow it to gently drain out on its own. The meat is be cooking now for some time. I'll check to see if they are ready. And at this point, all of the meats and nicely cooked i'll remove it from the stove and i'll transfer it inside an air fryer basket i'm going to be air frying the meat you can also deep fry the meat if you prefer i'll transfer it to the air fryer and air fried from time to time i will come back and give it a stir so it doesn't get burnt i'll also be using salt with fish, locust beans, season cubes, hard boiled eggs, red palm oil. I'll transfer the palm oil inside a pot and I'll be bleaching the oil on a low heat for 25 minutes to 30 minutes. Cover and leave it to bleach. Once it's 30 minutes, allow it to cool down a bit before opening the pot. And this is what the bleached palm oil looks like. If you leave it longer to bleach, it's going to get lighter than this. Add sliced onions. I'll fry the onions until the onions is translucent. Add the locust beans and stay. Frying the locust beans helps to bring out the aroma from it. The bell peppers are well drained out now and this is all the liquid that came out. I will save that for another recipe. I'll transfer the peppers inside the pots and stay. I'll add the blended crayfish, salt, season cube, and then stir. Cover and leave it to fry for about 30 minutes. The air fried meat is ready and this is what it looks like. They were very, very delicious. And if you are going to be deep frying the meat, you can fry it with the palm oil as well. The stew is be cooking now for some time. I would add the fried meat. 
boiled eggs and stir. You can taste and adjust the seasoning if needed. I'll cover and leave it to cook for another 10 minutes. 10 minutes later, the stew is ready. I'll give it a stir and this stew smells divine. The stew was very, very delicious. Stirred very well and removed the stew from the stove. Next, I'll be boiling some ofada rice to enjoy the ofada stew. I'm going to be washing the rice off camera. I have some water boiling in the pot. I'll add salt. Add the washed rice. And stir. I'll cover and cook the rice for 20 minutes until the rice is ready. 20 minutes later, I'll give the rice a nice stir and at this point, the rice is ready. I will turn off the stove and cover the rice. I will serve and enjoy. You can also enjoy a father stew with any type of rice of your choice. Add stew. And I'll enjoy. This Ofada stew was super, super delicious. If you enjoy watching this video, let me know where you're watching me from. Thank you all so much for watching. Remain blessed and I will see you in my next video.